<laughs> oh, all right. Fine. It's rubbish. Okay. Okay, uh, what about this then? There's, uh, apparently now available 1.5 million pound apartments available on an exclusive ship which sails around the world. Yeah, it's like, uh, make of that? it's a huge thing and you just, you, you live on it and it's, I mean, in theory. How big, how big is it? It's, um, it's mental. Do you it's know like huge a town minor. in the centre. Do you know how, like, people said that the Titanic was the biggest ship? Was that only then? They've got yes. bigger ones now, haven't they? Yeah. A lot bigger. Oil tankers are much bigger and... Yeah. No, but actual liners are big. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was it was the biggest then, yeah. Because my mum told me that there was one that that was that was that big that it had like rough areas on it. Oh, oh, oh! Don't go starboard. Oh God! No, but do you know That's what I mean. Right. It was like we're, a, we're thinking of moving. We're seeing yeah. the captain. We're thinking of moving to a nicer <laughs> area. Oh, yeah. I mean, I, I've heard they're very rough in aft. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, that's They fantastic. steal your tyres. A how? ship so big that was <laughs> rough areas. Oh. How, how big is this one that, that you're <sighs> talking about? Uh, well, I don't know. It doesn't <sighs> give me the spe specifications here, but they stay huge. huge. They're huge. Um, in theory, I mean, it's, it's that thing with, um, uh, it's obviously marketing, but, um, they're gonna, um, uh, solve, uh, the, uh, um, overpopulation crisis where soon we'll all be just be floating around the sea, yeah, but. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I can see that, because, I mean, think about it, right? I've been talking to Ricky about it. I was open to buy somewhere in London, but there is no way in this world that I can afford it, right? Um, and you look at all the, all the wasted space, like, with the Thames, all <laughs> it's doing is, like, collecting crisp packets and stuff and yeah. Coke cans, and people have to clean it up, whereas if you think, if you've got a load of boats on there... Yeah. Problem Perfect. solved. Yeah. Would you live on a boat? Problem solved. Uh, what's his name did it, didn't he? Uh, what's that program? Is it Bergeron? Noah. <laughs> oh, Bergerac? There was one where, where he lived on a boat. I think it's quite- was That it was a uh, shoestring. Yeah, I, I'd give it a go anyway. <laughs> no, uh, I'd like to see you, um, living in, in the air, maybe in a giant hot air balloon. Yeah, alright. But, um, no, the boat thing, um, cause it, it, it is gonna get bad as well, isn't it? They're saying that the water's melting or whatever. The water's melting, the, yeah. The ice is melting. Yeah. And, and there's gonna polarized. be more water and less land, so yeah. in the future it's probably gonna be the way we're gonna be living, isn't it? Have you seen that film Waterworld? Nah, I don't fancy it. Because yeah, that, 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 that sort of predicts that, yeah. What, are they saying that the ice thing exactly. as well? Exactly, yeah. But at the same time, um, I was thinking about this a couple of weeks ago. <laughs> if you get, I mean, I think I read that, like, a big chunk of ice, uh, fell off one of the ice, uh, what do you call them? Caps. Ice caps. Something like, the, I think they said it's the size of the Empire State Building or something. Right. It, it snapped off and went into the water and it's melted. And they saying, oh, it's bad news, you know, that, that something that size is melting. But the way I look at it, if something that size falls into the water, it's like a big ice cube, and it's gonna freeze it up again. You, you with me? Not that, really, Carl. Go on. Right, you get a giant ice cube, yeah. the size of the Empire State Building, yeah. stick it in the water, yeah. it's gonna make, uh, that, it's gonna stick back on again, isn't it? Well, no, uh, only on if again. it freezes up again. Yeah, well, it, it will freeze up. The water's well, won't, gonna get cold again because you've just put a giant ice cube in the water. Well, so when you put <laughs> when you put an ice cube in a drink, the drink doesn't freeze, does it? No, the ice it's not. If you put one the size of an Empire State Building in your glass of Jack Daniels, <laughs> it's gonna make it freezing. <laughs> <laughs> it's not going in a glass of Jack Daniels. It's going in the ocean. I know, but I'm, that, you see, that I'm using my fables. Imagine a <laughs> world. <laughs> Use your brain instead. <laughs> imagine the world, imagine the sea, yeah. like the Arctic or whatever, as yeah. a glass of Jack Daniels. Okay. A big ice cube falls into it. Yeah. It freezes, it melts back on again. So it's, we're all right, I don't know why everyone's <laughs> worrying. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Thank God for that, I was getting panicked. Oh, fine. Do you understand what I'm saying? Yeah, no, you're right. Yeah, that will happen. <laughs> Should we play some more music and then come back to Wi-Fi? <laughs> yeah, this is, this, this is better is, than this ever. This is, this is dynamite, this week. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>